The best from two countries meet tonight in international hockey. Before we begin, the final thoughts of Eddie Olchek. We're standing on the world stage, Doc. The players know this goes beyond any one league, and they're representing their countries in this matchup. From the outside, not on the net. He's trying to go top bins there, but he shoots it over top of the net. Down to the corner. Setting it up. Presses that attack. Collected in the corner. Wow, that's got to be a call. That's got to be a penalty. And that's got to be an answer from the other team. Oh, well, he's bent over, pushing himself slowly to the bench after that huge hit he received. Team Canada's working ahead from mid-ice at the boards. A hit that can make you mad. He's certainly on a mission out there. He's trying to set a tone for his team in what should be a really physical contest. Terrific pass through the middle. He's got it on his stick. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. Missed. Slid to Weber. Puck is thrown to McDavid. Shakes right through. Loose now picked up. He's got that one. You couldn't diagram it better than a chalkboard. Perfect pass. Skill play by Keith. I love when the game is like this. Everybody has to think. Everybody has to react. There's no time to slow the game down. Hangs on to that one for a stoppage in play. Looks like he's going to need some help here. That is a crushing, bone-jarring hit. Over nine minutes to be played. Still nothing on the score sheet yet. Nice face-off work. Great Britons along the wing at center ice. Intercepts that pass. Maybe he can generate something. And he gains the zone. Tremendous job done defensively there with a the poke check. Stays along the boards. To the point it comes. Oh, what a hit that one was. Well, he got jolted there. He wasn't expecting to get hit like that. Back to the blue line. Back at the point now. Trying to go to Marshand. Pitching it to Ben. It's dumped in. Great Britain's in possession in their own end. Outstanding body contact. Gets last ability around the league is eye-catching, but when he uses the body, everybody takes note. Flings it. Outstanding glove save. This is the way you eliminate a player in the middle of the ice. Perfectly executed. Nearing the final minute of play. Pass attempt to Sagan. Side to side they go, trying to generate something. Out in front. Score! That's a crucial goal, guys. You score that late in the period, you have momentum going into the locker room. The Canadians now have a one-goal lead in the first period. Perhaps they can build on this and carry something sizable to the dressing room. Neutral zone face off one. Possession established here. Assisted by number 92. Turned right away with the poke check by Alex Petrangelo. First period has been played. An interesting start to all of this. Continuation in just a moment. Only one goal scored. Lots of time left to play. Limited edition team breaks are available tonight at your team store. Canada's one goal lead was gathered in late in the period. Let's see if they build on it when the second period starts after this.
Second period about to begin here. Let's take a look back at the first. What impressed you most? Great Britain's lucky to still be in this game after the first period. They had turnover after turnover. I'm sure the coaches addressed that problem in the intermission. And down to Hall. Propelled to Stamkos. Snaps a wrister. Hall, that was close. From that position on the ice, he's got to hit the net. Make the goalie make a save. Snapping a pass to Keith. Takes a shot. Great save. And decides to just hold on and get a stoppage of play. Over three minutes off the clock here in the second. The Canadians lead 1-0. Clean win on the draw. Big drive! That one came closer to the Zamboni doors. Boy, that puck was really humming off the stick. Unfortunately, it missed the net badly. Oh, he got in the way of that one. It's blocked. it again. Let's it go. Save. Wheels around behind. Punched away. Weber's tripped and a penalty should be coming. Great Britain's only going to get two minutes on this call, but it was tripping. Oh, this is clearly a tripping call. He made no attempt to play the puck and took the legs out from the attacking player. Team Canada's power play is activated for the first time tonight. Always important to win the special teams battle, or at the very least, come out even. Right to the point. Sends it back the other way. Pitch to Doughty. Keeps it going behind the net to Giroud. Point to point to the half wall. Centering. Throws it in front. Elevates a pass to Hall. And he gets it back. They've got all the gunners out. Slides it to Doughty. Down low. Steps away from the boards. And he gets it back. Throws it to Weber. Sends it. Gray glove save. The Canadians win that faceoff. He scores! Winning strategy on the power. So he's in good position here, but the shooter's known to be a real accurate shooter. He doesn't have much room, and he doesn't miss it. The Canadians have now made it two to nothing. They have been overwhelming. They've won the faceoff. Scored on the power play by number That is up close and personal. Oh, he's been looking for that hit all night. Tremendous hit. Stamkos gets rocked. When a star player gets it, you know that the intensity of the game is going to climb. Goalie's one of the six guys on the ice. He can pass. He did that. He hangs on and gets the whistle. So satisfying to have delivered a hit like that. Down here, you can hear this hit throughout the ring. We have a winner. In with it now. Good pass off the boards. Now it's directed to Tavares. Laid on to Doughty. Back to the point. A shot. Missed just wide. You've got to hit the net from there. I thought for sure he'd at least get it on net, but the goalie didn't even have to make a save. Jostled off the puck. Carries it on in from center. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. Goes back deep for it. It's 
skill play by Giroux. May not have been intentional, but he got it anyway. Back and forth they go between the points. Got a piece of that one. Good shooting place. Rings it off the post. LaBelle sure would have gone a long way for them as they try and climb their way back into this game, but the post denies them. And a save. That puck is held, and the whistle stops play. This always makes the fans stand up and take notice. What a crunching check delivered. The Canadians prevail again. Very important steal for him. Well, they got to be a little tired after these first two periods of play, so they'll get a rest as we start to think ahead toward period number three. Hey, fans, don't forget our 50-50 draws coming up in the middle of the third period. Get your tickets now. The Canadians end the period with a two-goal advantage. We focus on this one, the one that made it two goals, and we'll have more in just a moment. Third period about to begin. What did you think of the second? Great Britain's coaching staff, Doc, has to be pretty pleased the way they played through the first 40 minutes of play. One area of concern has been their offense. They need to take advantage of all the time of possession and finally put the puck into the back of the net. Has it in his own end. Great Britain's marching on halfway up the ring. Loose puck blocked off by Crosby. Cuts that pass off. Takes that pass. Got the blocker on that. A shot. Oh, he got that. The Canadians have been really solid defensively. Their goaltender has not had a very busy night at all. The shots have been few and far between, but he's been sharp when he's had to be. You can't run around looking for big hits like this. These come right into your lap. The Canadians with a clean win on the draw. Team Canada's in the neutral zone along the wing. Terrific open ice hit. The defense can rest. Anytime you get hit in the open ice like that, that is a jolt. In the slot. Shot on goal. And it away. Moving it to Stamkos. Passing one off now to Weber. Gains the zone. And possession has changed. Brilliant move on that pass. Got it on his stick in the slot. A superb hit. A great hockey play there. Muscled long to Burns. Read that play in his own end. Great Britain's making their way through center ice at the boards. Gives it to the point. They score! It's only a one-goal game now. What a quick release on that snapshot. No way he's going to miss from the low slot. Yeah, so that's a good shot, but the goaltender's got to stop this. This is low on the glove side. His hands have to be in position to cover just over the pad. Great Britain's deficit is now just one, and we're in the third period. Still time to get this back even. Face-off win, and now what will they do with it? Takes it in from the neutral zone. And by number 22, time of the goal, 10 minutes, 20 Puck picked up here. Points it. Really good cut of the pass. Scooped up by John Tavares. Handled with the stick. That puck was obstructed by a screen. Oh, he'll take shots like that all night. Keep feeding them those muffins. He's going to stop every one of them. Yeah. 
Under seven minutes to go in the third period. So some success here. And they've cut the lead to just one. Great Britain's controlling play in the neutral zone. On through the corner. Got it at the point. Right there, but can he get it out of harm's way? The Canadians are moving the puck in neutral ice. And moved down to Marshan. Kicked out of the scrum. Oh, and it's a penalty coming. Team Canada is taking advantage of the delayed call. The goalie is off. Great Britain's two-minute penalty is for holding. The referees are looking for that particular play where the player drops his free hand off the stick and reaches in. Two-minute holding call. Anything you do once, you can do twice. Let's see if that applies to this particular power play. I like their setup on the power play that scored earlier, Doc. Let's see if they can get it set up again to move the penalty killers around for a couple of good chances. They won it. Now what can they do? Hits the post. Would have been nice for an extra cushion if that puck hits the pipe and goes in. That's still frustrating even though you're in the lead. They win the draw. Let's see if it pays off. Wonderful stop. Critical face-off, and they won it. Couldn't get it out. Score! What a power play these guys have. David's first step was the right one. He got to the front of the net and received the pass and put it in on a one-timer. His technique is good. The butterfly is really solid. He just gets beaten with a better shot here. And the face-offs won. Cut off that pass at center ice. Pitching this one to McDavid. That one is pointed to him. Chip to Burns. Shoots one. Saved there. Great Britain's looking to hit man up the wing. Last minute to go in the third. Goalie is gone. Extra man coming on. Net open. Score! net goal will send the fans to the exits. That's going to be too much for them to come back from that empty net or will seal the deal. Team Canada's got it off the draw at center. That puck's loose, mishandled. Jutes got his pad on a changing shot. Great work with the stick. Great pressure. Looking for room. Score! Sidney Crosby! Crosby's great individual effort while on his knees surprised the goaltender and he scored. Good work to get into the open to receive the pass, but that's a beauty of a dish that opens up the pass lane, gives him time to shoot the puck. A 
terrific job at the faceoff circle today. Just like that. Takes that pass up the boards. Got it in his own end. He's got it on his stick. Perfect off that left wing. Shoots. Terrific save there. Didn't look like he had anything to shoot at. And he made it tough. You got to find a way to put it in the net. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. Nice face-off win. Dings it off the iron. That's like Doc being on the end of some bad games, some bad efforts. I'm not looking forward to practice tomorrow. And again, we thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed the evening as much as we did. For Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emmerich saying good night.